That is fire, though. I really do appreciate this, though. Like, stickers, I always put on my laptops. Um, I'm definitely gonna wear the shirts, so, and the socks. Appreciate it, for real. What's poppin', world? I'm LG, and right now you tune into an episode of Living and Growing. Right now we in New Orleans, Louisiana, my hometown, visiting one of the homies' garden. Welcome, we about to check it out. Journey with me. I'm John LaCarpia III, and um, this garden is our family garden out here in the night world. And um, we actually named it our family garden because uh, we consider everybody our family. So that's what we named it. Explain the process that you use to grow everything. Not You didn't only use water and, right. and soil, you know what I mean? Yeah, you yeah. use spiritual. Could you explain that to me? Um, so uh, I tend to meditate every morning mm -hmm. um, and mostly praise the sun in the morning. Mm -hmm. um, my days start about 3 a.m. Mm -hmm. I'm um, paying attention to whatever the planets is in the sky. Mm -hmm. uh, lately it's been starting with Jupiter and Saturn and then Mars. Mm -hmm. And then right after that you got the sun coming mm -hmm. up. And, um, and so I'm meditating and um, that particular day, um, I just so happened to see like five um, hawks ah. circling. All right. And when they were circling, I saw a, a halo, a, a, a rainbow halo around the sun. All right. And so when I saw that, like I usually uh, get this feeling because five is my number. Hey. Uh, so. <laughs> you did. You did. <laughs> five is my number. Uh, and five so, is my number. <laughs> and so since that's my number, mm -hmm. Um, it told me to uh, just pay attention to what's going on around me, and I just started. Uh, my one of my meditations is uh, like a little childhood game playing I Spy with my little eye. All right, all right. So all I'm right. just paying attention to everything that's around me, and then I saw the flower, and it was just so beautiful to me. And it's like yeah. something about it said we had just made a flower essence from uh, another flower, mm -hmm. and so I was like, hmm, I wonder if you can make it from okra. Like right, I didn't right. even know. Right. I just went with my gut. Right. And so I just did it. Uh -huh. And it was just so happened to be the new moon. Mm -hmm. So, new moon, set my intentions. I said I want this uh, flower essence to help me build this garden. Mm -hmm. I want this flower essence to give me the energy to uh, put into the books I was writing at the mm -hmm. time. Mm -hmm. Like a whole bunch of different things. Mm -hmm. And I did it. I also don't uh, treat them. All right. I don't do nothing to All my uh, plants. Yeah. Nothing to them. I don't put no pesticides, no nothing. Mm -hmm. I believe in uh, cooperative economics. All right. So even the even the bugs and uh, everything else, they get they, they gotta, they gotta yeah. eat. Yeah. They gotta yeah. eat too. Right. And right. um right. and I talk to them. <laughs> right, right, right. And I'll right. be like, yo, just make sure we have some too. This is normal. I'm, See, gonna, huh? I'm gonna bless you with some merch from the Living and Growing Project. Thank you for Word. letting us come through and check out, you know what I mean? Thank you. You living and growing, you embodying the brand, you know what I mean? I appreciate yeah, that, yeah, Doug. Thank you.